Hello guys, welcome back to a Boom Beach video. Today's going to be a little bit different. I'm trying to mix up the videos if you guys can't tell. Maybe get some new content in here. Just have it a little bit more fun in Boom Beach. Uh, but today I'm going to be talking about uh, the current state of Boom Beach. Now we did a video like this a, a little while ago, but what we're basically going to be talking about is Boom Beach dead. Is it still a playable game? Uh, is is Boom Beach dying? Is Boom Beach? We're just going to be discussing the current state that Boom Beach is in. So, uh, I just want to point out that I'm not hating on Supercell. I just there might be things that Supercell could be doing a little bit better, and I might say stuff that Supercell is doing an amazing job at. But yeah, we, we're basically, I don't know behind the scenes, so I don't know if stuff I'm saying is impossible. But uh, I'm just going to be giving you my state on. Boom Beach. So this video might be a little shorter than a normal video, but just sit back and enjoy. And uh, yeah, let's let's get into it. So when you start out by the updates of Boom Beach, so Boom Beach definitely has not had an update in a very long time. We haven't had news on an update. The Boom Beach team was gone for the entire month of July, and uh, but still it. <laughs> And we've had like four months, three months that we haven't had a Boom Beach update. So we're going to be talking a little bit about that uh, right now. So first off the bat, uh, I would I want to say Boom Beach is dying. I'm going to go out on a limb and say Boom Beach is dying. But I'm not even just going to stop there. I'm going to say Supercell is dying. Or so it seems. Now let me explain myself a little bit. I look... At Supercell games and I say to myself okay some of these games will not die for a very long time but then I look at the youtubers making those games and us included and you look at any any youtuber that's making Supercell games the last couple weeks the last couple months for that matter the drew the views have been dropping so much guys where we're getting like we're, we're it, it's, it's insane and it's not just us like pretty much every supercell youtuber is half the views versus what they were a couple months ago so uh, there's a couple factors a couple of reasons why this might be the case YouTube on their side could have been doing something so YouTube could have changed uh, the way videos appear in search results and uh, for that matter, all gaming YouTubers are screwed, basically. But uh, it doesn't seem, <laughs> to me, it seems kind of like Supercell is dying. And for that matter, Boom Beach is definitely dying. So there's a couple ways. Uh, see, the problem is it, go, it comes back to YouTube. Because even if YouTube changed the search results, that's going to affect Supercell and affect Supercell YouTubers in a negative way. Supercell is so big for a mobile game company. And that's because they have YouTubers that play the game on a regular basis, bringing a lot of traffic into the game. And Supercell knows this. So that's why they partner up with, not partner, this is why they send stuff to their YouTubers. That they support like that's why Nick and Molt they get uh, flown to Finland a lot and they just do a lot of creative marketing I guess you can say so it's not even the fact that uh, Supercell might not be dying but when YouTube changes something and less people are watching Supercell videos or even mobile gaming videos that's gonna affect traffic on Supercell games imagine this scenario you, you love watching Molt, and I'm using Molt and Nick as examples because they're just humongous YouTubers, but you love watching Molt. But all of a sudden, you, just, you, only, you only watch maybe half of Molt's videos, new videos coming out. That in turn is gonna say to your, you're gonna say to yourself, okay, Molt, uh, I'm not watching as many Molt videos, so you might not be excited for Clash Royale stuff because Molt is a Clash Royale YouTuber. So it does affect when, when YouTube changes something, it affects us as YouTubers, but it also affects companies like Supercell. So, uh, even though we are Boom Beach YouTubers, it's not that Boom Beach is dying, it's that YouTube changed the way it, it works, basically, the way videos appear in uh, 
your homepage or the way related videos work. Um, and it kind of sucks because we're literally like, make, only getting like half the views than what we were a couple months ago. But you know what? I don't, I don't care at this point. I, it's been pretty obvious for you guys. I'm not saying I don't care about a channel. Uh, I've just been having a blast, just having a lot more fun making videos now than I was a couple months ago. And that's because I'm just like, okay, I don't even have to worry about making videos that get views or traction because none of our videos will get views or traction. So I'm just gonna make what I want, which is good for me, but hopefully you guys are enjoying the content as well. So uh, it's a very tough topic to try to wrestle with, but now let's actually get into Boom Beach. We'll talk a little bit about Boom Beach uh, and uh, is, is Boom Beach dying? So not looking at YouTube as a factor, it is Boom Beach dying. Uh, I don't know if Boom Beach is losing players or gaining players or it's kind of holding players uh, because I'm not, I don't have access to those stats. Uh, but if I were to make an opinion, I would say Boom Beach, the older players are starting to leave the game because it's boring. It might be bringing in new players, uh, but I don't even know how much new players they're bringing in. I haven't seen a Boom Beach ad in so long. They're not even... They're not even funding like advertising, which sucks because no new players are gonna join the game. But then again, I haven't seen any Supercell advertising. So maybe that might be a factor. <laughs> maybe when Supercell is advertising, Supercell videos will get, no, that can't be, that can't, be, that can't work. <laughs> um, so yeah, just a bunch of factors. So Boom Beach, if I could just sum up so far what I've stated, Boom Beach needs to fund advertising because games grow by advertising. If you like Boom Beach, you if you never hear of it, you'll never download it because you'll never hear of it. So it's kind of, uh, I don't know what the budget is like and if they have room for advertising, but I feel like it would be more of an investment. But I'm, I'm done talking about advertising. As for Boom Beach content, in-game content, uh, like I said before, I bet older players long-lasting players are starting to leave because it's boring like okay I finally mastered AZ I uh, played with a leaderboard team not me but I'm talking about late game players uh, there's the only part the only thing that's left in the game for people who want adrenaline rushes is uh, operation attacks which is big in Boom Beach because there's like a casual player then there's like operation players so uh, and then there's people like me that are kind of in the middle so I feel like Supercell needs to kind of bring out some sort of big feature to come back in the game and bring back players but yeah I don't that's not I, I can assure you that's not happening anytime soon because this is what I have been saying for the last couple of years and literally nothing has changed but on a different note in a couple months, Boom Beach is coming up on the fourth anniversary. So maybe they have some big update planned, some big feature. We need features, not just new heroes, not just new events. Like, it would be cool if they added a, 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 an event to the Cycle of Evil, but in a couple, in like four weeks or so, it's a five weeks, six weeks, the event's just going to be, okay, whatever. I don't care about it. Like, it, it. It's interesting, just digging into all this type of stuff. So yeah, uh, to iterate over it, if you guys feel like Boom Beach is dying, I'm so sorry guys, uh, but I kind of feel the same way. But it, it, for my opinion, I don't even see it as Supercell's fault. I see it as YouTube's fault. So, uh, but yeah, that's pretty much everything I wanted to cover today. Uh, I feel like streaming is the way of the future and uh, because streamers don't, really lose viewers concurrent viewers uh from like the previous streams but the problem is guys i can't stream because my setup is awful and i just want to point something out guys i my computer uses uses up so much power that i literally can't plug my mic into my computer i have to plug my mic into a laptop that's running on battery so if you see me looking down here that's why I need to plug my microphone into my laptop to get good sound that's not all broken up because it's not getting enough power. So I can't even stream 
my computer's not strong enough, but I wish I could stream. Streaming would be so much fun. We used to stream uh, when we were a lot smaller on YouTube. But, uh, yeah, that's pretty much all I wanted to talk about. Kind of give you guys my opinion on Boom Beach's current state. Let me know your opinion because I want to know how you feel about Boom Beach. Have you been seeing uh, maybe like lost a little support in Boom Beach? Have you lost a little enthusiasm in Boom Beach? So let me know down below. I'm excited to see your results or your comments. I'll talk to you in the next Boom Beach video. Bye.